St. Charles County is charged with murder following a shooting in Wentzville, and a neighbor is getting credit for helping put an end to a six-hour manhunt. Thanks for joining us. I'm Mike Bush. And I'm Ann Allred. Just over an hour ago, the prosecutor's office shared the name of the victim, Leon Anderson from St. Louis. Five on your side's Megan Kernan reports from Wentzville where it happened. Uh, there's someone running around who I just heard murder someone. Kimberly Moore lives in the neighborhood behind Hidden Valley Drive and heard the entire argument from her back porch. It was around 1030 Tuesday night when she suddenly heard a woman yell, what are you doing? Multiple times. It's a scream I've never heard before. You could tell from the way that she screamed that something really awful had just happened. The woman told police she was in the bedroom with Carlos Hood, who she started dating about a week ago. That's when she says her on and off boyfriend of three years, Leon Anderson, showed up and broke in through a bedroom window. I heard a male voice say, get out of here. After a few minutes of arguing, the woman says Hood grabbed a gun, shot Anderson, and ran off into the woods. The victim ran out of the apartment after being shot and collapsed near the parking lot. That's when the woman called 911. We sat around until about 3 to 4 in the morning with helicopters out, uh, megaphones, yelling for whoever it was to come out with their hands up. After about six hours of searching, officers caught Hood with the help of a neighbor's ring camera. Sergeant Jacob Schmidt says they're praising the resident who came forward. They knew we were looking for somebody in the area working this investigation. The detectives went over and, and reviewed that and identified our suspect, uh, confirmed that that was our suspect. So then we closed in the perimeter uh, on that area and thankfully we were able to take him into custody safely. Hood is facing charges of first degree murder, armed criminal action and unlawful use of a weapon and is being held without bond. The woman said the victim didn't threaten Hood or herself during the argument and was looking to get to the bottom of the relationship.